Hi there, welcome to something of everything. In this video, we will learn about linear elastic analysis options in step 1. Let's click on analysis print. It will show the analysis print commands available in step 1. This is perform analysis that is used to analyze the structure elastically. That is print options. That is no print, load data, static load, static check, etc. Let's have a brief about all of them. Perform analysis does the linear elastic analysis of structure. If you select no print, it will not print any analysis results in the output file. If you select the load data, it prints all the load data in the output file. If you select static check, it provides summation of all loads and gives the reactions summation of all reactions of the structure and with that it provides moments of all loads and reactions taken around the origin S statics load it gives everything that the static check, statics check does the data will be too voluminous it would be better to use statics check than static load. If you don't want all the data, load data to be printed. Mod check. It prints mod checks values at the joints for all calculated mod checks. Both. It is equivalent to load data plus static check. And all. It is equivalent to load data plus static load. If you want to do linear elastic analysis, you have to select one of the options from this. From my suggestions, you should always do the static check or both. Let's add that and analyze. We have added the both static check. Okay, let's see what the result gives us. analysis is being done. Let's go to the output file and see what the results are being given. It creates pages around 500 more than that. It goes and goes and goes. Let's see how much pages 1763. It's created due to the load data it has given us the static check and cg ok and what we had added to the results i guess we added it to both this is what it is giving right? let's see what it is it is this is the input file which is by default being printed in the output file. These are the joint weights which we have given in the seismic analysis. This is problem statistics, number of joints and all those things. This is earthquake, what is you can call it edge value that we are finding. Then value of base shears. These are the loading load combinations envelopes and this is the load data that you have told it to print. This is the member, these are the loads being applied to it. This kind of load being applied to it. This is the whole bunch of load data. And at the end of it we have total applied loads, total moments and CG of the structure. This is being printed because we have added this in the input file before. You can add this from here also. Post process, define command, print CG and add it. The command has been added here. Okay. Thank you for watching us. Keep watching something of everything. Do share the videos with your friends and colleagues. Thank you.